well, well, hello there people. Welcome back to my channel. And in this video, which is gonna be a short video, I hope, I wanted to discuss something with you regarding my Evo and these Evos in general. And the issue that I'm having is an issue that many of you Evo owners have experienced and it has to do with brake squealing. It's a pretty common thing in the Evo world. Many people think it's cool. That is me included. I really don't mind the brake squeal on these cars because I think it harkens back to the rally days, like when a rally car comes into the service area and you kind of hear like the hot brakes are squealing like hell. It's kind of cool, but when the brake squealing is a result of dirt and crap being wedged between the pad and disc, ruining your discs, then it's not cool. So let me turn around the camera so we can have a look at what I think is causing this. So this is the right front brake setup and wheel and corner of the car. This is the caliper, this is the disc, and when you're driving, the disc is going like this. And with the caliper being located on this side, I do think that potential sand and crap and dirt coming into here is being wedged between the disc and the pad. And you can see my discs how they look like and you see they have scoring i'm a bit uncertain about that scoring there this side is pretty mint you know my theory is kind of backed up by just looking at the pad you can see the scoring on the top there is made by a lot of crap and sand on top there of the pad on the bottom there's nada same on the inside pad, located like this. Lot of scoring on the top, bottom, nothing. So there's definitely something going on here with this angled pad. Dirt and stuff are being accumulated on top here and making these marks in the discs. So having this ground angle on here makes the risk of vibrating pads a lot less because if you don't have this the the attack angle of the disc against the pad is too great so you can risk that the pad is like starting to vibrate like that obviously the other way around though i do think that uh, a square like a, a pad without this angled side would solve a lot of the issue so that's it people if you do have any comments any suggestions Leave them down below in the comment section and I will be happy to read about them there. So until next time, have a good day and uh, see you guys later. Bye bye bye. <laughs> see ya.